Hi, in this video, we will see how to write in a file. Before you start writing on your file, we know we have to use open method because open method is used to open, to read and to write. So we will use open method first to open the file and after that we will define the mode inside the open method and finally we will use some method write, write or write lines to write the file. I am using Visual Studio Code for this tutorial. Uh, this is the empty folder. There is nothing. So what I will do at first I have to create a Python file. Suppose the Python file name is write, write file for example dot py py. This is a Python file. That's why this py. And this file actually will use to write something on a file. So we, if we recall, then we know, then we have to use open method to create a object of a file. So I am using the open method and inside it, we have to give a name of the file, which is mandatory. Okay. So here I am writing the file name is like my file dot txt. This is my file. And then we have to uh, define the mode because we want to write the default mode is read. But if we want to change the mode, we have to mention it here. So I'm typing mode equal to write. And we can also append uh, whether it is binary or text. I'm going to use T for text. But this is optional. This T is optional. If you uh, type W, uh, then it will also work. But I want uh, my program more specific. So if I mention this clearly, it is better. But you can use only W also. And then I'm also uh, typing the encoding also here. For me, the encoding is UTF-8. I will use this encoding. Okay. And in this way, we can open a file and let it define under a variable like F equal to this. So it will open the file. Here, this F is a file-like object. Okay. And inside the open method, we define uh, this will be our file and we are opening is a wt mode that means write uh, write mode and it will be a text and we are using this encoding now to write the file we have to use the write method so we can use f dot w r write so this method and inside the method we can type some text whatever we want to write suppose uh, we can write like fast line for example okay and once you complete this we have to do one thing we must have to close the file right if you don't uh, close the file, then you might get some error or problem whenever you will do a lot of file processing. So it is a good practice whenever you open the file. Once you finish processing, you have to close the file. Let me run the program and let's see uh, what it will give us the output. So here there is no file, right? So now I'm going to run the application uh, by click, right click and then run current file in terminal or we can click this arrow button, green arrow in Visual Studio Code. Uh, both will work the same and if we run the application then we'll see it executed okay and here we are seeing that there is a new file it created my file.txt this is the exact file name right which it created and let me open the file and if you open the file we are seeing that there is a text fa uh, first line which we actually mentioned over there now let's run the application again uh, and let's check what it will happen so i'm going to run the application right click and then run python in terminal it is running again and if we open the file again we are seeing that it is still the first line but we executed two times so why there is online so basically whenever we open the file write mode and then we are right, trying to write the file it will start writing from the beginning it will erase all the previous things of old file and then it will replace with this new text okay so let me uh, check one more time because previously we had first line okay so let me do one thing let me put it uh, first line after change so just to show you whether you are uh, working properly or not uh, that means uh, it is modifying the whole file or not so let me run the application again we run the application and let's open the file and we are seeing that first line after change so basically it is not actually adding uh, on top of that it is completely removing the old content of the file and then it is creating the new content of that file so uh, 
uh, this is very important okay so whenever you are using right mouse more method uh, it will do what it will do it will remove everything and then after that it will start writing from the beginning okay and there are a couple of other method is also there uh, for write but the, uh, for if you want to write multiple lines so there is a method it called write lines so we can use this write lines and then here we can actually uh, mention all the uh, all the lines here suppose uh, like i want to write like a b c three lines okay so i type a then uh, we can write slash, uh, slash n then b then slash n then c slash n okay so we can also write this thing so if we run this application let's see what will happen we run the application and then open the uh, file the file name is my file dot text and if you open then we are seeing that it is doing this thing but here one important thing uh, i want to mention you uh, that's why actually i uh, created this uh, i wrote this thing uh, in this way so here f dot write we wrote this line right first line after change and after that it is writing uh, f dot right lines a b c so this uh, right slash n that means new line character okay so one two three it is creating three new line but before a there is no new line so where should it it, it will start will it start from beginning or end so let me open the text file now you see uh, first line after change okay this but the a starts from here okay that means whenever we are using this thing uh, the right point it will actually point to the next code point it will not jump to the next next line if you want to jump then you have to put it manually from there and uh, these two are the main uh, things to write the file uh, but there is another alternate way if you want to keep your old content uh, over there uh, and you want to write after that then you can use uh, or that means you can open uh, this file is append mode so for append mode what we have to do we have to change this w to a a for append okay and in text mode so if we run the application we will see this content will be the same but it will start writing again after that okay so let me run the application again so it run completely and then let me open the file and what do i see it is opening uh, sorry it is adding all the things again right so append actually is used if you want to add something with our existing file at the time we will use append mode otherwise we will use w mode write mode and one other important thing is uh, in python uh, there are these two are the right methods but there is no right line thing okay so don't use this this is a mistake uh, don't use and if you go uh, to the help you can see that if you need any help uh, related to file okay you can actually easily check through the help window or help command okay so if this f is a file like object right so what are the uh, necessary methods or something is available of this f how can we check we can actually check easily we can write a, a code uh, like f dot not f actually help we know how to use help uh, i showed you more details in the previous tutorial uh, when we actually discussed the open method at that time i showed you here if we want to check what is related to f f is like a file like object right so we can put f and finally uh, we can put it in a print method right so we can type command print then inside it here now uh, if we run the application what will happen let's run the application and we'll see the help up there so here it is showing all the related methods or something let me increase the skin a little bit it will be easier so here see these are the methods are defined here this uh, f method supports and if you scroll then you will see uh, read line and then we are using right line right so right this is right method okay we can use this right method uh, on top of it and then also if you scroll then you will see uh, right line also so this is right lines but there is no right line there is always right lines so these two are the available methods uh, under right okay so that's all so in this way you can easily uh, write a file and if you wish uh, there is two option to write either in uh, regular mode uh, like wt and there is append mode uh, write mode uh, 
basically if you use uh, right mode then what will do it will remove the all the old content and it will add new content and if you put append mode writing then what you will do it will start writing after the previous file so all the contents of your old file will be still available but it will create uh, the new content at the end of existing content that's all thank you for watching i think uh you have a clear understanding how the python write mode and append mode works uh, to modify some file or to append some file so hopefully by watching this video uh, you will you have a better idea about the right uh, writing things on text file and in the next tutorial i'll show you how to uh, read from a text file and lastly thank you for watching the video if you like please like the video and subscribe to our channel